Oh my god, you goofy goobers. The St. Patrick event is about to, um, like, release in this game. And they have added this new clover crate, which I think is everything in this update log. Uh, yeah, it's just a limited clover crate. And I've heard it has some pretty insane units. And, well, I need gems for these, and I do not have gems. Hold on. Luckily, the developers have given me admin commands. So, we can just go ahead, pop my username up, and then say, what do I want? I want gems. And let's go ahead and do, um, how much gems? Let's do 25,000 worth of gems. And there we go. We have 25,000, or 25,000 gems. And here we go. Let's go ahead and summon. Come on. Please give me this unit. Please. I beg for it. Um, it would be very nice if we could get a first try. Come on. Okay. Yeah. We absolutely did not get a first try. But we did get the first two. The Leprechaun Cameraman and the Shamrock Cameraman. Nerd Cameraman. Actually, no. This is a speaker, man. I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm very tired. I'm trying to record this video at 11 a.m. right now. Don't see I just said 11 a.m. It's 11 p.m. But anyways, let's continue opening this come on I need the best units. Please give it to me Okay, that is like 20 crates right there down the drain and we got nothing. So here we go 30 come on Um, that is still not it dude I feel so bad for like whoever's actually spending robux on this because I hope you guys have good luck If you are buying this personally, i'm gonna be trading for these units in the main game but um trying to get them here it is very expensive bro come on please give it to me um i still have not gotten it dude that is like 40 units come on clover crate aren't you supposed to be lucky I i'm not having oh wait why did i just open one imagine this is the one come on please uh be in here maybe come on and no of course it's a leprechaun cameraman here we go come on dude Please, I, I have a feeling it's this one and oh my god, I forgot to apply my boost I think I have some luck potions that I can apply. So let's go ahead and quickly leave this exit Yes, and then um, we need to go to store and where is it boost? Um, I forgot. Oh, yeah, it is right here. Okay. Um, oh my god I don't have any Wait, I have an idea if I go over here link account and yes, okay verify that no, that's only a coin boost Oh, no, dude. There's no way for me to get boost are you serious right now? Okay, well, I guess we're doing this without any luck, dude. And come on, dude. Which one is it? Please just give it to me. What is it even called? I need this godly. I, I don't think we've even gotten the second tier one. Oh my god, we haven't. Okay, we've only gotten the first tier and the second tier. So I'm going to just go ahead and quickly speed run this. This is like the 70th set, I think. I'm pretty sure somewhere around there. And so far, we're still getting poopy rewards. Please give me something good. Guys, I can't do this video if I don't get the godly. Please give it to me. I wish there was a way to skip this animation even for the last one. Like, I wish I could just, like, click skip and it would show me everything I have because this is a lot of stuff that I am just having terrible luck with. Um and still nothing okay this is the last nine that i can open because you can only open nine in this game but we can go ahead and give ourselves more gems if we don't get it come on please give it okay that was 90 crates right there and we did not get it neither did we even get the second tier one bro are these chances even real okay well let's go ahead and just give ourselves more um gems and let's try this again 20 30 more oh my gosh i still can't get it dude i just oh my god yes we got the mythic we got the mythic okay okay that is good um now we just need the godly give me the godly that is the last one i need the godly and the mythic are pretty close in stats or aka the lucky tv woman but i'm pretty sure that the godly does something that the mythic doesn't like it has an ability or something so come on give me the godly i have yet to see like even the godly inside of this passing by thing so hopefully it doesn't take too long but at this point i've opened around 130 or 140 my luck is terrible when it comes to saint patrick oh never mind dude we just got it let's go there's the lucky titan clover man i'm, I'm pretty sure that is what it's called there we go yes titan clover man we are done with that and let's go ahead and equip this dude so all we need is the new unit so we have these three and then including the left 
leprechaun cameraman there we go that is all four of them so this is everything new in the update and i am also gonna go ahead and equip a scientist which hold on i need to get there we go i have gotten all of them and including the scientist cameraman and now let's go i jump into toilet town why am i a noob um hello did this game really just call me a noob why why am i a noob all right, let's see if this new unit cooks or if it is cooked because, bro, it, it better be pretty good. It took a lot of gems for this. I'm so glad I did not spend my own Robux on that, guys. I'm doing this for you guys. And if I hadn't spent all my Robux on that, mm -mm, it wouldn't have been good. But, dude, why am I still a noob? I look even more ugly than these toilets. We're going to go ahead and turn on auto skip because we need to start generating some moolah. And if we don't have money, we don't have fun, which means we're probably going to die. And right Right now, all of these units are expensive, so we're probably gonna die. But they do all cost 500, which is interesting, except the Mythic. And oh my god, this guy looks sick. Okay, before I start drooling over him, um, we need more money so that we can actually play stuff. Luckily, they have given us good range on all these units, so they will be good pretty, or pretty good off of the start. And let's go try with the TV woman. I'm assuming it's going to be AoE. So... Uh, I have no idea where we can place it probably right here because it's taking a while for the enemies to actually get here Okay, here we go there that works and there it is. So wait, is that not aoe bro? I thought the lucky tv woman would be aoe. It's a tv woman, but Damn, you know what? I, I cannot say that. Nope, I, I'm not gonna go that way. But damn, okay, I need to upgrade my scientist cameramans, or by upgrade, I mean place down more of these guys so that they can make us money. And there we go, they just gave us 400. However, we're gonna need a little bit more. But the TV woman is pretty solid right now. I mean, it's able to handle these guys pretty well, um, considering the fact that it is the only unit we have placed down. But as soon as the next wave starts we'll be chilling and the mythic is very cheap to place so i'm gonna try to place down the mythic i want to see if this is like something that you know you could possibly be using a lot nowadays i mean dude he looks so cool i hope this guy is really good and come on do we have enough money yes we do let's place him down and there he is oh my god that is an interesting effect so he automatically starts off by shooting out of his chest instead of anywhere else bro i thought he was gonna shoot out of his like camera but i guess not and he has a dps of a thousand so far keep in mind the price difference between the clover man and the lucky tv woman are not that different and the tv woman does half of the dps of the clover man and i'm pretty sure the tv woman was a mythic so this guy seems pretty good okay there we go i upgraded him and now he is doing a dps of 2000 and it looks like it's in the next upgrade that it does start getting a lot better however i'm gonna need three thousand dollars for that and i do not have that wait a minute what is this wait who spawned that one of them just placed down a gold pot um i have no idea which one of the units do that wait so is it like a barrier and yes it is and that's pretty cool I don't know which one dropped a gold pot. I would assume the Titan Clover Man since I upgraded it. Yeah, it just spawned another one, but it instantly got destroyed. I'm pretty sure this is the dude. Look, there it is again, bro. It's in the same spot. Okay, might be the Lucky TV Woman. Let's go try upgrading her. And okay, her DPS also went to 1,000. I need to upgrade the farms a little bit because these guys are not running us much money anymore. All right, finally have enough to upgrade the Lucky TV Woman once again. And there we go. We are at 2K, 2.5K DPS. Bro, can I like reset my character? Why do I have to play as a noob? I don't appreciate this, man. Also, I'm pretty sure, by the way, some of these units are meant to be AoE, such as the Titan Clover Man, but at the moment, it is not. So by the time the update is out, I would assume it's going to be changed. I'm going to go ahead and place down another uh, TV woman right here just to experiment what is like actually summoning the gold pots, even though I'm pretty sure it is that fat dude over there. Um, I think it might be the TV woman. Let's save up a little bit more, though, so I can get this Titan Clover Man upgrade and hopefully 
hopefully he does a new attack. I mean, it doesn't say he does on the upgrade feed, but we're, we're just gonna pray it does. There we go. Let's go ahead and upgrade him. And what changes about you, bro? Okay, looks wise, they don't change in this game. So I noticed that. But oh my god, bro. Why does this unit look so good? Anyway, this guy is an absolute beast doing 3.5k DPS. So nothing is able to get past. And next upgrade, his cooldown is gonna become 50% like shorter. So that's gonna be really good. Also, it's spawning in more gold pods. Look at this. And their HP actually increases on upgrade. I have absolutely zero clue what unit it is. It, I'm pretty sure it's actually the Titan Clover Man. Because I'm trying it over here. And I have not seen this uh, TV woman spawn a single one. So that might be the perk for the Titan Clover Man, which is unique to it because no other unit in the game does that. And look, there's a third one. I don't know how many it's allowed to spawn, but I think it can spawn a lot. Let's keep up with these farms, though, because we need to upgrade them. And that way we'll make more money each way. If I get 3000 more dollars, I'll be able to upgrade this Titan Clover Man to level three. And that would be one level away from max. The max DPS for this guy is pretty insane, especially if he's going to be doing these gold pods. I don't know how good it's going to be when they get to the max level. But we are able to handle everything so far. Nothing has even gotten through, but we just need money, dude. There we go. We can go ahead and upgrade him. And now he is insane. 6,250 DPS. And in the next upgrade, it becomes 3k damage every 0.2 seconds. And yes, it is this guy that is spawning in the gold pots because the HP just went up to 5,000. So that's pretty good. I mean, if you want to add that to the DPS, which I honestly don't know how you would, you can tell that there is a good damage difference with him. This spider toilet, though, does not stand a chance and why does his model still look like this like he does not even look like a spider i do want to max him out though so we are very close to do that but i think we're gonna have to upgrade our farms one more time before we have enough oh my god some stuff is getting past dude okay maybe this guy needs a little bit of backup but i mean he's still doing damage to him very fast i don't know why he stops targeting some of the units though oh wait i've set him to target the closest okay yeah there we go now he's doing a lot of damage this is a unit though that i will say you should probably set to target strongest so that it's killing like all the bosses you don't really need this guy to be breaking or destroying like these toilet police uh oh that guy kind of got through oh no okay um we are about to die this is not good Oh my god, we are about to get cooked, bro. Okay, please upgrade and don't let us lose. Come on, come in clutch, please. Titan Clover, man. I beg you, kill the other thing. And yes, okay, we got it. All right, we got this guy in the back for backup. And hopefully, he keeps spawning in these gold pots. I'm gonna need more of those, man, okay? While I upgrade this one. Oh, yeah, this dude already placed down three gold pots. Let's go. I am assuming it is capped to three, so I don't think he's gonna spawn. Oh, never mind. He can spawn in four. This guy might be really good in the back, dude. I really like this unit. I'm not even gonna lie. Not only does he look sick, he is very good. And okay, dude, you just ruined my collection. Um, okay, I just lost, but let's upgrade this guy. And there we go. He's doing 15k DPS. Look at that. He is insane. I barely died, bro. And apparently there's a cap of placing two of him. Yeah, you can only place two Titan Clover Mans, which does suck because I just tried placing a third to save my life. And well, that clearly did not work out. But he can spawn, I believe, an infinite amount of these gold pots. So it's definitely a unit you want to place near the back but not all the way in the back i do like this update overall though i think this is a pretty sick update probably my most favorite unit this yeah oh look at that so now he is aoe um after level three he does become aoe and he spawns with a pot of gold every 30 seconds with 250 health and he has a max of 10 of those the pot of gold though does increase in health which is kind of insane and if it's a 5,000 by max level the pot of gold if they're doing 5,000 by max level at uh 10 they will do a total of 50,000 dps and hey look at that little rainbow they have a here that is so cool wrl update let me know what you guys think if you enjoyed this video by the way watch the video on the screen it's one of my best videos yet and i think you will very much enjoy it and also i had to open a lot of these exclusive eggs so please